One of the biggest time wasters for teachers is putting part of an Australian content description into Google. One of the ways that Scoodle can help them address that is by filtering and getting quality resources. So we're getting quality resources but we're not investing a lot of time in looking for them. They're matched exactly to the curriculum content description that we need, which is important. So it means that we're delivering on what we need to deliver on and we're satisfying the requirements of the curriculum. This Australian curriculum link, so each content description's got the unique identifier. So we click through there. We get a little bit more information in the elaboration and we also get a link to Scootle. Beautiful activities, lesson plans, units of work. I'm at Bingra Central School, which is a prep to 10 school in, in New South Wales. It's probably an hour out of Moree. I'm working with the schools, looking at developing teacher content knowledge and supporting them to develop a good solid curriculum. Say you like a few of them, so I really love these ones. We're going to add it to what they call a learning path. Now a learning path is your collection of all of those things that you liked for that content description or that unit of work. One of the things I really like about Scoodle is using learning paths to make a little collection of resources on a topic. So the learning path is a way of filtering through the documents that we like or the, the activities that we like and then we get a URL and that URL is really handy because I can send it in an email to a friend, I can put it in our planning document. I think the teachers can see that a learning path is going to save them time. So once they've curated the content and they've got something that they're really happy with, they can add to it later on so they're not throwing the baby out with the bathwater with all of their planning, they're just next year, the next time they go in and do the topic, next term when they're doing addition and subtraction again, they can then reuse that content and maybe add to it. So they can share it with their colleagues, they can share it with someone on the other side of the country, they can share it with their students and families. And I think they've sort of they've really been surprised that that facility is available. So the learning path to me is, is probably one of the best features of Scoodle. It just means that teachers have got access to things they've already filtered through, they've already liked, they've already used and they're, they're quite comfortable with um, and they can build a nice little collection that can be used year in, year out if you like with a few tweaks to make it better each time.